What does the Bible say about pride? Pride. It's a sneaky thing that can creep into our hearts unnoticed. The Bible has a lot to say about it, and trust me, it's worth paying attention to. Proverbs 16, 18 warns us, pride goes before destruction, a haughty spirit before a fall. This isn't just a poetic line, it's a profound truth. Pride blinds us to our own faults, making us think we're invincible. But the reality? It sets us up for a fall. James 4, 6 gives us hope. God opposes the proud, but gives grace to the humble. Imagine that. God himself stands against the proud. But for the humble, he pours out grace. It's a reminder that humility opens the door to God's blessings and favor. Humility isn't about thinking less of ourselves, it's about thinking of ourselves less. It's about recognizing our need for God and others. Jesus, our perfect example, lived this out. Philippians 2.8 says, And being found in appearance as a man, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to death, even death on a cross. So, let's take a moment to reflect. Are we letting pride take the wheel, or are we walking in humility? The Bible calls us to choose the latter, to embrace humility, and to experience the grace that flows from it. Let's pray for humble hearts and remember that in God's kingdom, the way up is down. Humility leads to true greatness. Keep this in your heart and let's live it out every day.